Tonight, a Midland home catches on fire. The cause may be holiday decor you have in your home. Good evening. I'm Katie Orth. Eddie Flores has the night off. Big Two's Jocelyn Person spoke with a firefighter today to get some safety tips. She joins us now live with that. Hi, Jocelyn. Katie, within the last hour, crews boarded up the windows where the live Christmas tree ignited, but thankfully no one was injured. But to avoid having, but to avoid having this happen to your home, there are some safety tips to keep in mind. It was around 9:30, um, and I heard my mom come running out of the house, running over here to screaming. And so when I came outside. I saw her over there trying to like bust in the window and go in. So my main thing was like trying to keep her from going in there and pulling people out. Everything is completely burned in this Midland home because of the ignition of a Christmas tree. And, um, so of course I was pretty stressed out. Um, I th really thought my mom, she's the type of person that'll run in there and try to save people. So I knew that I didn't think there was anyone there. So I was trying to pull her back over here across the street. And then we came over here. My neighbor was fighting it with his water hose, and the poor guy was eating all kind of smoke. In hopes of keeping your holiday season merry and bright, here are some fire safety tips to keep in mind. A lot of times, the the cause for the fires that uh, people plug in too many lights into one outlet, uh, which draws a lot more. It wants to draw more power than it can, so the wires get hot, they melt, and that's what causes the fire usually. It takes less than 10 seconds for a Christmas tree to turn deadly. The timers that you can put on it, maybe, maybe put a timer on it to have it shut off after 30 minutes, an hour. But I would highly recommend if you're not going to be home just to unplug it. Just wanted to tell people, go check your smoke alarms, go check the batteries, and go do it now because that could be you and that could save lives potentially. Reyes also advises you to water your Christmas, your live Christmas tree and throw it away once it dries up in order to prevent a fire in your home. Reporting live in Belint, Jocelyn Person, Big 2 News.